içme yasağına uyumuz. Sadece işaretlerle gösterilen bölümlerde sigara içme. Good evening ladies and gentlemen from the flight deck. This is your captain speaking and we are here with airport CEO. So I spent the better part of all of last week and oh no, it's fine. I forgot to unmute my stream. So that hopefully doesn't get caught up. And if you'll hear that, it'll be excellent. Um, yeah, we're live. I've been in airports for most of Saturday and Sunday. I know it's Monday now, but it was terrifying. Some sleeping at the San Francisco airport, very uncomfortable floors. MSJ is here and he says the red zone is for loading and unloading of passengers only. There's no stopping in the white zone. But yeah, hey everyone, welcome back. We're back, we've been off for a week. I've been in Maui, which if you've never been, you need to go to. I know the music is very loud. But what we're gonna do is start a new airport. Let's begin a new adventure, yay! I wanna first point out, this menu looks like it was written by Stegs. Like, Stegs 101 is, seems like this would be his kind of erase your past. Let's adjust them. Like, imagine these as like steaks. Like, what's annoying you? Anyway, have a safe flight. This is the kind of thing steaks would say if you want to say goodbye. Yeah, Vecco's here. MS Chan's here. Let's begin a new adventure together. That is a terrifying looking face. Let's go with the that face. I part my hair that way. I think. Let's go sort of dark hair, skin color. I got a tan. It's probably closer to my actual skin color. I have brown eyes. I'm gonna have like like that. Not, let's be less terrifying. Um, there we go. And we will be Jack. Good. Us. Continue. And the first thing we want to do is confirm our airport location. And we're gonna go all the way in here, up here, and we're gonna. Click right about where the airport is. Confirm airport location. It'll be Kahului International. <laughs> airport, uh, it's KOGG, I believe. Um, like airline tycoon. I like the menu. Um, since it's, that also, that also looks a lot like what my shirt looks like right now, except it's got a little something in here. Um, we're gonna play moderate. It's not gonna kill you. But the CEO can be challenging. And then we're going to launch Ka Louis International. K-O-G-G. -G. I like Airline Tycoon, the menu. The menu's great, man. I haven't played Airline Tycoon. I don't think I might have. Um, blah, blah, blah. A lot of work ahead of me. Last person didn't even build anything. Gregor Fonsworth. I don't think Gregor Fonsworth is the menu. Or the menu is the mayor. Hi. It's been a while. Um, let's pause. First thing I want to do is pause. All right, I'm going to scope out a pretty basic. Oh, guys, this is so sensitive. Let's build a pretty basic road. We're going to like do that, and then we're going to build, I think, like that. Um, we need, most important thing for us is bus stops. I'm going to have at least, let's do three, and then... Hmm, sorry, I'm thinking. We'll do something like that, little, so you can have like parking stuff in here. Does that make sense of the bus stops there? I left an extra space, we could have a crosswalk. Here's what I'm gonna do, is I'm gonna move, I'm gonna use the Colonel's favorite tool. Structures. Oh no, I did it wrong. Infrastructure. Bus stop, I have a third bus stop there. I think this will work. You're wearing a Hawaiian shirt and Bermuda shorts? Nice! Becca boy, you know how to live the life. Um, we'll put a sidewalk in through here. That's what we're gonna do. We have a little like, boop. This will be all sidewalk. We'll eventually put parking and stuff in here. Um, car drop-offs will be like, let's just start with a couple and we'll run the sidewalk that sort of does this we'll just do that it's it's not super you know fancy we have a loading site we have that um all right that'll be the first thing we build the first thing we want to do with that though is let's get our contractors on the go i believe that's under contracts um 
57 deployable, 7 per hour. 57, 7 per hour. I think they're the same. We'll sign a contract. Now we're going to find our employees. Staff and vehicles. Operations. That's the one. Construction. Deploy. Let's, we don't need all of them. Let's just deploy like 25. Probably need a whole group. It's really nice. How's the weather? Yeah, how's the weather over in ye old jolly England? Um, deploy 25 contractors and then we'll get them working. Let's get some building done. Here comes the... Departed from Kahului. Volvu HWY must be our work. Airport is closed. We've got mail. Uh, I don't need the tutorial. A lot of work to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know how to play this game. Glorious sunshine and barbecue heat. Nice. It's like 65 degrees here, which is not what I wanted. I came, it was like, I don't know, 85, 90. Um, over in ye sunny, jolly Maui. It was 90 on Friday, but it was like in the 80s most of the time. And I just, I just want that back, you know? That was me plugging my phone in. I'd be curious what that noise was. Ooh, wants to, much to do with my phone. Oh, you can't see that. I'll just leave it. Hey, look at all the happy construction workers getting their work done. So we're going to build ourselves an airport. Yay. 27 degrees. Well, that's reasonable. I'm also talking Fahrenheit if those, there are people who are confused. Look at these guys, like, are they brushing with their hammers? Brushing with their hammers, brushing with their hammers. This is cool, they're just building roads. Um, 27 degrees seems fine. Let's do a little speed up. Let's sort of get some more construction done. We're $223 an hour to build this stuff. Seems like a lot of money we're losing, especially because we're not making any in. Operations, no ATC, no runway, no aircraft, airport closed. Yes, generic, got new applications. Cool, good to know. Can I clear these? Thank you. I don't care about new applications. Look, it's a bus stop. Oh, I s oh yeah, it's going the right way. So buses will come, blue doo doo doo, I think. There's a by car, by truck. All right, let's just let them build stuff. Once we build this, we're going to pause and start our terminal. Kick yes! Hey, man, thanks for the bits. Yeah, welcome back. Yeah, uh, Maui was super fun. I don't know if anyone here has been to Hawaii, or been to Maui specifically, but it's like, it's paradise on Earth, man. There's our bits, get the cheer on. Little zombie running across the screen. I just get custom things for that. Yeah, I did Maui was, oh, it's so nice. In Fahrenheit, it was like 80 every day. Who's this guy? Oh, that's me. Hiring date, day one, year one. CEO of Kahului International. I see like white hair, it looks black. Oh yeah, that's accidental. Can I tell him to go places? No, he just stands around. All right, let's, uh, scrolling is super fast. Let's see if I can do it. Nope, it's just gonna be super fast scrolling. I, so I didn't see the volcano, I posted a lot of pictures to Discord, and actually every, I posted to a bunch of Discords, just to make people jealous. Um, I climbed to the top of uh, Haleakala, which is a non-active volcano, so I saw one from the top, I saw the crater, but I didn't see, uh, what's the one erupting, the one on the Big Island, the one on Hawaii proper. Um, Kilauea, yeah, I saw one of the days the wind shifted and we saw ash from Kilauea, like it was a beautiful sunset, but most of the days, like, it was pretty clear and the wind was pushing the ash south and west of us. Yeah, Kilauea, it's a good volcano, but I, there are a lot of cool Hawaiian place names, I ate a lot of really good food, I had pokey and I had calamari um, steaks, which is like cooked calamari. 78's here. Uh, 78, we're talking about Kilauea, which is erupting on the big island of Hawaii. And we're also talking about, um, what else is it? Oh yeah, sorry, Haleakala, which is the big mountain on top of Maui. So it looks like half of the people in chat are Dutch. That's how I expected this to go on my first day back. 
I'm getting welcomed back by the Dutch. Um, quick question, very important to me. Who is everyone super excited for the World Cup? Even those people who don't have teams in it, aka me. I'm very excited about the World Cup, and I'm very excited for uh, Iceland. That's my team right now. All right, let's do some more building. Build structures, build a foundation. So Iceland for me is like the team because I don't have one, and that's what I do is I then root for Iceland. I don't want to be like, I want to go from here. I want like, I'm going to have like this be my terminal for now. Um, can no, need to build an AC air traffic control tower eventually. I might build it like just off the terminal. Let's put it sort of over here. Let's put it like that. There we go. That'll be fine. Um, we'll start with we'll start with that. We'll start with the ATC tower and the basic terminal building. Right, I realize the Netherlands did not qualify, which is why I'm asking the Nederlanders. Oh, Kikia said. You merged with Belgium. <laughs> Wait, so you guys have to root for a Belgium now? Yeah. Uh, 78, to give you an idea, the mountain I climbed, the big mountain, Haleakala, is 10,000 feet tall. Which, you know, that's a pretty pretty hefty hill. 78, you're going pro-Germany? Huh. They will pay back the whole amount of Poland gets to semifinals. So you're rooting for Poland then. I feel like Poland could do it. Um, I want a medium slide door. I probably want a large, my main door would be a large slide door. Boom, there we go. We'll do that. Go Belgium. Yeah, I'm definitely going for Iceland, because, like, that's it. One of my coworkers is from Argentina, and Argentina starts with a game against Iceland, or plays Iceland early in the tournament, and he was so upset when he heard that I was going to root for Iceland. But they had a whole, like, ad campaign, which was Team Iceland, which is to get U.S. fans to support them, because, like, you know what else do they have? Icelandic fans. All right. No, oh, I need, I'm going to start building a runway, too. Let's just work on all those sorts of stuff. Let's build ourselves. Where is small runway? $100,000. Put the runway here. Let's be runway number one. And I want to build taxi foundations. We're going to build, like, this... Gangsta concrete taxiway. Be too wide. Two by six there, and then we'll put. Can I give spaces? Two spaces? Two spaces? Yeah, two by six here as well. Five, six. That'll be our first. First taxi stand. Go, England. <laughs> Wait, 78, are you just going to support everybody? Because it sounds like. You're just sort of supporting anyone at this point. You're like Germany, Belgium, Russia. Stalin is ring. Stalin's dead, man. Unless this is all like part of his master plot. Unless you think Stalin's still like controlling stuff. Which is entirely possible. Alright, the first thing I'm going to do... What's my first aircraft? I just realized how big this is. Hmm. Should I do small size aircraft stands? I think my runway is too close, but that's fine. All right, let's, they're gonna keep working on that. 
I don't think North Korea has qualified this year. South Korea has, though, and Iran has qualified. But then Nike pulled their uh, boots deal, like, right after they qualified, which I think is kind of crappy. But that's what people do, I guess. All right, what do I need? I need a check-in desk. We're going to have, so this will be like our main area. We're going to have our check-in desk. This will be a real small airport to start with. Kyle Louis is actually a much bigger airport than this. But we're going to have our check-in desk sort of like, do it here, I think? Up against the wall. I want to move it. Let's actually bulldoze. Let's go items. Check-in desk will be here. Oh, wait, whoops. Let's reverse it. We'll be here. I'm going to put an information screen in. That'll go sort of like here. I'm going to need, eventually, gate security. This is small security checkpoint. Oh, I need a secure zone. Well, I'll build here. Let's let's do a secure area exit. Let's uh, figure out how to do the zones. Let's build a secure zone first. Let's make like the gates and stuff. It'll be this. This will be all the secure zone. So I'm going to go back to items, find a security checkpoint. There'll be one just like right here. Then we'll have a, where's security exit? Secure area exit. Going that way, right? That'll be sort of over here. Alright, we're gonna spend a lot of money on this. We're gonna need I'm gonna build a couple small plane stands real quick. I'm gonna build a nice little taxiway. Put our tarmac like that. Um, I guess we just have this go along like that. That seems safe. Let's make it three wide here and then two for the rest of it. That's a lot of money we're spending, guys. Oh, I don't have my spacecraft dock. I know, that's right. Did I forget to make this? Whoops. Please be an asphalt runway. Close. We have air traffic control. What are we missing? ATC exists. I don't have to man it, do I? ATC just exists happily. Alright. So here's the exit. So what we're going to do is... We're going to build... We're going to wall this area off. Put another security checkpoint in, how's that? Uh, actually, let's put it over there. So let's go back to walls. Let me select my wall tool. For, why? There it is. Items. Security checkpoint, small security checkpoint. Boop. You, let's build a queue. i 
That'll be your Q, you build a Q to there. Um, I want to build doors. God, I haven't played this game in a while and it's changed a bit since then. Put the big slidey doors in there. Spacecraft dock and anti-aircraft. Can do. Just the ramps. I need boarding. All right, let's do that. Let's do structures, no items. Boarding desks. Oh man, these are like, I don't know how size, how big my uh, airports need to be. You know what I mean? And next we need a bathroom. So we're gonna put a little, I'm having area. Bathroom, there it is. Then we're going to build walls, because you know, you want walls around the outside of your bathroom. We also want little wood doors. Let's put it that way. And there. And then we're going to build... Where is... There it is. It's having trouble selecting toilets. Have, you know, a couple toilets, a couple sinks. Have a hand dryer. Right by the door. Can I build trash cans? There it is, trash can. Put trash cans there and there. All right. Uh, mobile d defense system. I need a radar scrambler. A new BF-109 or Fox Wolf 190s are good aircraft choices. I mean, that's an option. All right, let's have these guys build more stuff. Um. We're gonna need them to build faster so I can like have airplanes come in. So we're just gonna see what they do. Cause currently we've spent nearly half of our money and haven't really done anything except put in like this kind of stuff. Items, I'm gonna put in gate seating. Item position not valid. Gonna make this super uncomfortable. Um, what else do we need? I don't really need an info desk. That's what the info screen is for. See, they can see when their flights are coming in. And they can check in. And they can go through security. And they can hang out here. It'll be perfect. B17. <laughs> Carnelian topsoil is back. What's up, Tony? And tonight is... Wait, P-51 or A-10? Vecco boy, that's a bit of a stretch. Anola Gay and nuke some stuff. Isn't the Anola Gay a B-29? Or is the Anola Gay a B-17? I'm unsure. But my guys are building... There's really no sound effect, and that's weird. Good, you will now accept commercial flights. Oh, I'm going to security checkpoints to let people through. My other board, boarding desk is done. I'm going to open the runway. So they can arrive and depart. It'll take small aircraft, take general aviation and commercial. These stands are going to be 
commercial only. No baggage bay. Oh, so I need to hire people is what I need to do next. So how do I hire people? These are things I should know. Contracts. No, I want um, staff and vehicles. Few applicants. I need two. I need to find security. All right, filter by um, security. Who's the cheapest? Hire them. Filter by a uh, ramp agent. Airport staff. Let's hire one airport staff. Let's hire one ramp agent. Let's hire a service technician. Oh, a janitor. Who's the? Who's gonna hire for cheapness? Hire a service technician. God, they're expensive. I guess another airport staff. Oh, you're dirt cheap. Air, connect. 